Hi, I'm Chris Nelson, one of the winemakers at Crush Pad here in San Francisco, and I'll be directing the winemaking for both of the fledgling wines. Uh, today we'll be sorting grapes from the Doctor's Vineyard, which is located in the Santa Lucia Highlands in Monterey County, one of my favorite areas. This is just one of the many great vineyards we'll be working with for this project. Once we get the grapes into the winery, it's time to sort and to stem. Sorting involves removing things like raisins, leaves, and stuff we don't want to get into the wine. Something we refer to as MOG, material other than grapes. Oh, there go the leaf. It's like a video game. You can no, see it going. It's just... like frog yeah. <laughs> This wine's going to be awesome. It is Best wine ever. Look at this. We picked these grapes. We're selling them. After we remove the MOG, then we gently distem the clusters to prepare the berries for fermentation. The stems came off, and, and now he said that it's beautiful. He said he did this, and he said, look, it's, it's beautiful, and it, it is. What's the froth from, do you think? It's froth down here? <laughs> it's, uh, it's just juice is foamed up. It's very happy wine. It's very happy it's wine. Very happy wine. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> okay, now that we've sorted and distemmed our grapes, we're ready to send them to the cold room before the fermentation kicks off. So what does winemaking have to do with technology? Did anyone catch it? Did you catch it? Mm, no. <laughs> Let's just take a quick look here and tell me if you see what I saw. Do you see it? Twitter. Twitter. Well, what does that have to do with twitter.com slash Robbie Ferguson making wine? Twitter announced on Friday that they are actually launching their own wine. But why would a major uh, social networking site do such a wild and crazy thing? I have no idea. They're actually using this wine uh, as a way of raising funds to help with literacy in Asia and Africa. They're putting in libraries in native languages uh, with a program called uh, Room to Read, basically giving the proceeds, five dollars from every bottle sold, is going to Room to Read in San Francisco. Um, what they do is they then take that money and put it towards, uh, I guess, less fortunate uh, literary areas, places that don't have a library in their language, and put in books, essentially, is what they do. So, uh, so interesting to find that on Friday, Twitter announced that they're actually uh, going to be partnering with a winemaker to make this wine, and uh, they're actually reducing the cost of the wine down to $20 a bottle from, I think, around 50 and five dollars is going towards literacy um, so interesting also to note that the that the website that uh, that I'll actually post a link to it I don't have it up on my screen but I'll post a link to it uh, in the show notes for episode number 109 but interesting to note that they make the comment that well by supporting literacy we're also supporting Twitter because if you can't read you obviously aren't able to participate in things like like Twitter and social networking and being able to use the internet because literacy is very important when you're when you're looking at your computer screen, absolutely. So. And in order to learn Twitter, you have to learn how to spell words incorrectly. And in to order save to spell space. words incorrectly, you need wine. It's kind of backwards, really. <laughs> well, no. How do you buy wine from Twitter? Who you, do you pay? Who do you? You don't actually buy it from them directly. It's coming from uh, Flegling Wine. So they actually have set up a website, okay. and you can actually pre-order. It's not coming out until next year. But as you can see, they're already. Uh, already getting the crops in, and they're and they're starting to press the grapes. Mm -hmm. But because of the way the wine is made, fermentation takes place, the aging process. So it'll probably be about a year before we see that. Right. Before we see that wine. If you're in the states, you might be able to uh, get a hold of that. Uh, here in Canada, we're not going to see it. Uh, of course, overseas, you're not going to see it as well. Uh, but something that you will be able to get if you're in one of the uh, supported areas down in the states.